Diego State University has had a rough time during the pandemic. First, it joined a list of American universities whose fall semesters were upended by COVID outbreaks. There were more than a thousand cases among students and staff in the first month. And tonight, the university is defending its disciplinary protocols after angry parents criticized the school. The family of a sophomore tells our ABC tennis reporter Jennifer Kastner their daughter may be suspended for the entire semester for not reporting her COVID test results fast enough. SDSU said Monday that consequences for violating COVID-19 policies can include official warnings, suspensions, or even expulsions. A campus challenged months ago by its explosive COVID-19 case numbers, now criticized for its disciplinary action against students. You're about to hear from the father of an SDSU student who asked that we not show her face or use her name out of fear of retribution. He says she lives in a single room in the dorms. When she fell ill, he says she visited the county's testing site on campus where she tested positive, but waited four days to notify the housing authority instead of doing it immediately. She thought that she didn't have to because the test was done on campus. She thought it was being reported to the school. Documentation that she had signed for housing um, said that she should report results or contact with other positive students immediately. And immediately is not defined in any of the paperwork. He says she self-quarantined but still got in trouble. This is the letter the school sent. Options include taking an academic suspension for the spring semester or for this current semester. It means all the work you've done all this semester will be wiped out. You will be, you're giving up this entire semester. He says he's part of a Facebook group where dozens of other SDSU parents are sounding off about similar disciplinary actions for what he calls minor offenses during a rapidly changing pandemic. It seems like the school is very overhandedly uh, punishing students uh, in this environment. SDSU reports that due to privacy regulations, it can't give out information about specific cases, but states in part that it rolled out extensive education campaigns related to pandemic policies that the university community should adhere to. To date, 1,423 notices of possible individual or organizational violations have been issued. Additional notices of violation are pending. The student who we profiled plans to fight the school to avoid any suspensions. Jennifer Kastner, ABC 10 News.